me again and I want to do a haul video for some of the stuff I picked up this weekend. Um, just because I really like the stuff I picked up. I got some really good sales and I'm just generally happy with my purchases. Um, so like I said, yeah, I did some shopping this weekend. I had a weekend to myself where I was just like, I'm going to relax, do what I want to do, do some shopping, you know, and just, you know, have some time. It's, every, it's nice every once in a while to just be alone. Um, I think, and, and have a weekend just with no plans and just do what you want to do. And my boyfriend's coming next weekend, so I'm really excited about that. So I'm going to be pretty busy then. And then the following weekend, my friend Tracy's coming up, which I'm super excited about because we get to finally meet and then we'll be real life friends as opposed to YouTube friends, which doesn't really matter to me anyway, but she's still my friend either way, regardless. But I'm super excited because we're going to have a super good time and probably not sleep very much at all ever the whole weekend i'm gonna need a lot of like coffee and things but um i'll post her link below because you should check her out if you haven't and yeah so either way i'm just gonna get started i did do a bit of clothing shopping which i was super excited about which is really what i was hoping for in the first place but i'm not going to include that in this video just because i feel like it would be way too long so if you are interested in seeing what I picked up for clothes, leave me a comment and let me know and I will do a video because I just, I don't know. I was thinking about doing it, but I only kind of want to do it if people are interested. So yeah, so I'm going to get started. So I went to Ulta because NYX, Physicians Formula, Maybelline, Revlon, I think were all 40% off, which is a pretty good deal. And I initially went because I wanted to get the NYX primer, the skin toned primer, but they were sold out. So I decided to pick up two trios. These are my first trios from NYX. I have not um, bought these for myself. Um, and I don't have a whole lot of NYX stuff um, eyeshadows. And people always say how great they are. So I thought I would give them a try. So the first one I got is Golden Rust and Walnut Bronze. Um, so that would be golden, rust, and then walnut bronze. So these are the colors. And I just thought this would be really, really pretty for fall. Like they just seem like really nice fall colors. And then I picked this trio up and this trio is just entitled Lake Moss. And this one's really pretty because it has a green, a blue, and like a purple, and they're almost black toned, which I really, really like. I really like the black tone um, eyeshadows that, that come off just of the color, but really dark. I really think those are nice for fall. And then I picked up one of the Shimmer Strips. Because um, Physicians Formula is kind of pricey in the first place, but with 40% off, I, I could justify it to myself. So I got the one for green eyes, just because I feel like people with brown eyes kind of always get gypped. Because we always get the purples, and it's always just bland purples. And I like purple eyeshadow, it's probably one of my favorite, but they're just always just so bland and boring. And these colors were really, really pretty. Like this teal here looks insane. And I'm definitely excited to try these out. So I got that. Then I went to Bath and Body Works because I've been dying to get some fall candles because I'm burning like uh, sweet pea and lake moss or cottage lake from um yankee candle and then like a paradise punch one from bath and body Works. so i'm burning like summer scents and i just kind of want to stop that for now so i wanted to get some fall ones so i picked up two because they were buy one or two for 20 um which is a really good deal because they're 20 dollars usually just for one so it's basically buy one get one free so i picked up two i picked up cranberry woods and um, it's just a nice sweet, you can smell the cranberry, but you can also kind of smell like the crisp air and the fall um, scents, like the cloviness and the cinnamon. So I really, really, really like this. And I really like the packaging, like the picture. And then I picked up leaves, which looks like this, which I've gotten a lot of good feedback on, that it was a good choice. And this just smells like cinnamon and pumpkin. And like, you know, like all those primitive stores where I love primitive stores where you just walk in and it's like that cinnamony smell. It basically just smells like that. So I'm definitely excited about these. 
What I love about these candles specifically is that they bring me back, like, they bring back memories to me, like, sort of like perfumes, like certain perfumes make you think of certain things. These candles just make me think of fall and things I do in the fall. So definitely excited to burn these. And then I, they had the Christmas ones out, and I really wanted the Christmas ones, but I decided I would hold off because I didn't want to, like, get sick of, sick of them. Um, but I did pick up one because they were only five bucks, and I picked up this one called Winter, and this is winter in a candle. Like, it's, it's like the smell of, like, the, the smell of, like, chimney smoke when you're, like, outside, and the smell of cloves and pine needles and balsam, and just, like, if you were, like, outside somewhere in the woods, like, if you go... I know like when I was growing up we'd go chop down our Christmas tree at a, at a tree farm and this reminds me of it like it, it, it would be snowy and you could smell of all like the tr Christmas trees and the smell from like the, the chimney smoke the wood fire in the in the cabins and I don't know I just really really liked it I might start burning it now in my bedroom at night <laughs> okay I'll stop smelling it but what's really cool about this is I paid five bucks for this and I didn't realize this at the time but on the top here is a coupon for $10 for one of these three wick candles. And you can get up to five with this coupon, which is a really good deal because they're 20 bucks each. So it saves you 50%. So um, it saves you about 10 bucks. And it says on here, limit five. So you can get up to five, which is fantastic. So I'm definitely going to go back once they burn these down and winter comes so I can pick up some of the um, Christmassy scents. Okay, <laughs> and then I went to Sephora because I wanted to exchange a primer I bought. Um, I was at Sephora a few weeks ago um, with my friend Nicole, and that was the weekend we met Kat Von D. And I was Nicole just happened to pick up the primer and was trying it on her hand and said, "Hey, look at this," because she knows that I'm trying to get because I just have a hard time with my eyelids. Like I need something just like washes my eyelids out because they're just so dark and I've tried everything and I've tried the Too Faced which is not so bad and it's kind of like if I get something that masks out the color of my eyelids it doesn't work well as a primer so it's, it either does one or the other which is really hard so she saw the primer and said hey look at this and thought it might be something I should try so I went and I bought it and then when I got it home I realized that I had bought um, the smoky one which is a gray primer and I used it a couple of times, and then I thought to myself, I probably won't continue, like, I won't use it on a regular basis. So I decided to exchange it because I wanted, I wanted, obviously want to get the most out of something I'm buying, and I accidentally bought it and tried it to see if maybe I would use it, and then I just realized that I wasn't going to. So I went and I exchanged it for this one, and this one's called Skin. And it looks like this, just like all of her other packaging. It's really cute. Um, and I'm really excited to try this because it is very, very creamy. And you can, as you can see on my hand, it definitely has like a concealing like look to it. And you rub it in, and it just, I just feel like this might be good. It might definitely counteract the color of my eyelids. So I definitely definitely um, will give this a try. Maybe I'll do a review on it after I use it a few times. And then because I was just in a shopping mood and I really wanted this for a while and I just I didn't buy it and, I, and I, it was like eating at me and I have wanted it for a really long time. So I figured you know what you might as well just buy it it's really the last thing that's on my like makeup wish list for now. I can't think of anything else I'm dying to have. So I told myself that once I bought it, I would kind of lay low on some of the makeup stuff. So it is the Too Faced Naked Eye Palette, and it looks like this. And they have a smoky eye and a natural eye palette. But this one definitely just comes out to me, or speaks to me, or whatever. Um, and then, like I said, this is the packaging, and it looks like this. And you open it up. And these are the colors. 
and I absolutely love all of these colors and I cannot wait to try them. I'm going to probably do a review on this because I'm so excited about it. Um, but I just wanted to show it in this video. And it also has on the bottom here a little jaw that slides out. And it just has like a little applicator. But everyone knows applicators that come with things are pointless. So I was really excited about this because I have wanted it for a really long time. Since it, pretty much since it came out. So. And it was made in the Dominican Republic. And I love the Dominican Republic. So, either way, that is it. That is everything. Um, yeah, so if you've been hauling lately or buying stuff lately, leave me a comment. Let me know some of the stuff you've got. And if you are interested in seeing the clothes that I bought, please leave a comment and let me know. And I'll see you guys again in my next video.